This is wild. Watch this, y'all. Watch this. He rings the doorbell. And he tries to walk in somebody's house. Pushing the door. Owner of the house. She's right. And he got an accent, so it sounds like he's not even from here. You're inside of my house. Let me tell you why I'm right here. Because you walked in. No, because they opened the door and ran from me. That's no, they didn't. Okay, and I'm telling you that now that I'm inside your house, I own your house right now. Yes, I do. I own your house right now. What I mean? I don't care if you know your rights. I don't care. My dog will bite you if I tell her to bite you. So you don't bite your back. Tell your dog to bite you. And I will talk to you outside. I'm not going to talk to you outside. What the fuck? What do you want inside my house? This bring is disgusting. Bring your supervisor to my home now. Yeah, bring them all. You have no right to be inside. No, don't fuck them. Don't fuck them. You have no right to be inside because they open the doors. They're minors. I'm. She's right. This is my home. She says she's the adult. She's not my daughter. Get the out of my home. I'm not gonna get her out. Then call your supervisor right now. Right. Call your supervisor. For fifteen minutes. And put me in the ground. I put a dog there. This is my home, bro. You're in my house. You're in my house. Now he assaults. You're in my house. You're in my house. Stop. 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 Assault. They should sue the fuck out of this sheriff's department. You're good, Did I hurt you? Did I hurt you? Did I hurt you? I told you, right? Did I hurt you? Did I touch you? Everyone, did I touch you? Keep this on video. I am, I am. Yeah, keep it on video. Your supervisor right now. Mama D, come inside. No, they don't have to. Please, Mama D. No, don't go inside. Don't. Don't go inside. Don't have to go inside. Don't go inside. Don't go inside. Don't go inside. Now, now, oh my God. Don't go inside. Keep it on. Now listen to him. Oh, look at all these cops coming. Solutionaries, this is the disgusting shit. This is why when I hear dick riders like Tatum and other so-called conservatives advocating for the unconstitutional standing army that the founders said we do not want. This is why I openly disrespect clowns like that. And I'm pretty sure there's gonna be guys that go like, oh, oh, all she had to do was comply. The level of compliance when someone is violating your rights and your property, your life, liberty, pursuit of happiness and property, that's out the fucking window. That's out of the window. This guy lied about, oh, they opened the door and ran when they saw me. You rung the doorbell, you pushed the door open, you don't have a warrant, you're not supposed to be in there. That's the end of the fucking conversation. I can't wait for one of you cock smokers to jump in here and boot lick and talk about, oh well, it would have just, we need more. All of the context is there, okay? There was no call about violence. He wasn't there with backup. There was none of that. This is what we're talking about when we're talking about letting Americans actually be Americans. This is unacceptable, and the only way that this changes is when especially conservatives start calling this bullshit for what it is. He assaulted this woman. She didn't be she was not aggressive. He was not in the right. She did not touch him, and he grabbed her and then arrested her. I hope she gets $10 million off of this shit. At what point are you going to stop being a bitch? At what point are you going to actually be an American and say, there are things and codes of conduct that need to not happen from law enforcement officers? When are you law enforcement officers going to step up? Because I want to support law enforcement officers that are actually doing the job of preventing crime or catching perpetrators of actual crime. I do not want to get behind egotistical, megalomaniac, bullshit dudes running around with a gun, a badge, and a uniform thinking they God's gift to earth just because they got some words on their shirt in that uniform. It's not okay. If you call yourself a constitutionalist, a freedom person, libertarian, Republican, if you call yourself some sort of American, you should be agreeing with me on this. It's not his house. He wasn't called. None of that fucking shit matters. Go get a warrant or don't come back, period. To even suggest or say I'm here, this is my house now. I hope this motherfucker get fired. I hope that whole department gets sued. And I hope that you're smart enough to agree with me on this. But I don't know, some of y'all are fucking dumb. Some of y'all are dumb and some of y'all are bootlicks. Comment your perspective below as well as make sure you go over to solutionaryuniversity.org. Sign up for a civics class. This type of overreach that leads into overreaching tyranny 
happens because they know that the general public is not aware of the actual rules in the civic process and they know you won't hold your feet to the fire. Go over, sign up for the class. They're once a week, they're online, they're only $20. You get a PDF right to your actual email. We learn from that, it's very interactive and you can start having some of the tools necessary to push back against this and get our country going back in the proper direction. My name is Maj Touré, the founder of Solutionary University. Hope to see you in class, be safe, be solutionary.